It is time. Welcome to Harry Potter Magic Awakened Beta Test. This beta test is limited to a number of players beginning on February the 12th, 2022 at 3am CET and ends at approximately two weeks on February 28th. Uh, at the end of the test, servers will be taken offline and all accounts and player progress will be erased. But we won't be going we won't be gone long. Look out for Harry Potter Magic Awaken on official launch soon. Thank you for the support and enjoy the special first look at Harry Potter Magic Awakened. Finally in freaking English. It's been way too long for this game to not get an English like aura. So that's the server I'm going in, I believe. Um, so yeah, let's, let's enter Hogwarts. I never thought my life would turn out to be anything So this is the more. opening. Until the day I received a very curious letter. But I've seen this opening many times before already. Before that day, my life was like anyone else's. That's not to say life was boring. In fact, strange things often seemed to happen when I was alone. When I told my parents, they laughed and said I must be seen. It's alright if they don't believe me. But I know what I saw. And then the letter arrived. And everything changed forever. What was that? Hello? No! Calipin Corgan! What a small room! Who are you? Rubius Hagrid, at your service. Hey, don't be nervous. I'm only here to deliver this. This is for you. I've been looking forward to this moment. Magic? Don't be ridiculous. I've been looking forward to this moment. It looks official. It has a crest and a wax seal. Y'all know I've been looking forward to this freaking moment. It has four animals on it. A, a lion, a snake, a badger, and an eagle. I guess I should open it. You bet you should open it, boy. This game's art style is beautiful. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry? Oh, it's a little slow. Right. You're gonna study match, 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 match. Well guys, it's here. Harry Potter Magic Awakened has finally been released. In beta. Which means that nothing is going to be saved, so there's no real reason to actually continue this kind of let's play -y kind of thing until the full game has been released. So instead, I'm just going to show you guys some gameplay from when I live streamed this over on twitch.tv slash edboynthek. And also advertise that I'm going to be streaming this game on twitch.tv slash edboynthek when we get back into it. Uh, the full live stream you can watch in the description if you are so inclined. But until the full game comes out, there will not be a legit let's play. I might show off some of the classes or something uh, at some point, but I'm not going to spoil any of the story if you want to stay clean to that. You actually have to play through the story to unlock some of the classes, which kind of stinks, but I'm going to have to do that anyway because I want to try out some of the classes. For example, History of Magic is supposed to be really cool. Uh, from the looks of things, it's going to be very akin to the Game Boy version of Order of the Phoenix. So that's going to be really cool. I'll explain more about this game as we get closer to the release, I think. But until then, I'm just going to be live streaming it. I'm just going to be chilling. I'm in the middle of moving. And uh, unfortunately, I'm not able to make proper content for the time being. Thanks each and every one of you though for the supportive words you've put into my previous videos. It really is nice to see a kind of community forming if that is something that's going to happen because that's really what I want in the end of the day with this channel. I want to be able to post Harry Potter videos that everyone can enjoy looking at the latest Harry Potter games coming out because it's a big year for Harry Potter. I cannot stress that enough but it's also a big year for me. I'm moving right now and until I'm finished moving, I cannot make actual content that isn't just a live stream every now and then. But I will try and do something. I, I need to keep supporting this beta because this game needs as much support as we can give it. Because it is a big Harry Potter game that I don't think is getting enough love because people take one look at it and go, Ew, card game, no. 
mobile game, ew. No, this game's gonna be released on PC, it's gonna be insane, it's a giant MMO, you can explore the castle, it's a lot of fun. Um, there's classes, there's a lot of multiplayer stuff, and there's a really cool story that takes place in like 2008-2009, in between the events of Deathly Hallows and the cursed book we will not name. Um, so it's really cool to see that this is the first time a, video a game in the series is going forward in time after Deathly Hallows, which is insane. So yeah, that's really the old update is. Please do support this game if you can. The beta is a lot of fun. Um, it's literally the entire game, but your save data will be deleted after the end of the month. So, you know, don't get too attached and don't buy any of the cosmetics because there's no point. You're not going to keep anything. I don't even know if you can. I've not tried to buy any cosmetics, but uh, I hope you can't because that would be not a cool thing to do if they immediately just close everything. They've said this multiple times that they're going to be like deleting everything afterwards so just do not do that but anyways guys that's gonna be me short video but you know i felt i need to upload something so enjoy this kind of stream highlight of me playing the game um and yeah thanks for watching <laughs> thanks for checking out my channel and uh, potterfan 9666 will be back soon i swear without further ado enjoy some gameplay Wizard Banking. Into the Gringotts. What's Gringotts got to offer? I think it's just the lobby, isn't it? Yeah. Oh god, I'm gonna have to do a freaking... I'm gonna have to do a ranking of all the Gringotts lobbies, aren't I? <laughs> Including the freaking PS2 Game Boy DS connection thing um how's it going george oh. hey little wizard how are you are you lost no i just heard there's an interesting shop here and came to take a look can you tell me the way back to hogwarts you won't be disappointed by anything here see the puking pastels over there do you like them want one I love this music. Oh, it's so reminiscent of like the PS2 joke shop music. Let's see if you can cast Plastral Pendo, Mr. Potter. I did a survey earlier. The survey was actually really cool. They mentioned um, the original game series and like Quidditch World Cup and shit like that. It was really cool to actually see that these guys actually care about the original game series. And then they talked about the the newer mobile games, and I'm like, mm, fair enough. But it's cool that that was at least one question talking about like how it was how familiar are you with the Harry Potter series, then how familiar are you with the game series? And I'm like, yeah, the game series. This is what this game is based on. Anyway, vi videos of like theories and stuff coming soon. Um, into the into into Hogwarts, please. The Great Hall. I'll show off the Great Hall actually because I didn't actually do that earlier. It's so Christmassy. <laughs> oh. It's so Christmassy in here. I love it. Oh, who's that running? Oh my god, guys, it's Harry Potter! Oh. <laughs> uh. Did I mention this game takes place in like 2008, so Harry Potter is like an adult? Yeah, he shouldn't be here, but what can you do? <laughs> really, they should have advertised that a bit more, like where this game series takes place, or this game takes place. The first sequel game, because all of the games since Deathly Hallows have been prequels, but this one's an actual sequel. Actually, every media has been a se prequel. But this is the first time there's actually been a sequel that isn't The Cursed Child, which is good because this doesn't really follow the story of Harry, but or the Potter family, but it does feature the Potter family, which is pretty cool. Well, it features it doesn't feature Harry's like, 
children, but it features Harry's. It features Harry himself. He shows up at some point because he's a he's a detective. He's an aura. What house am I in? I am in Ravenclaw, as you can see, because my character's blue. Or he's wearing a blue scarf. Alright, we'll go dueling club. I guess I have to do a duel. <laughs> Great, you get to see how shit I am at dueling. Um We'll do we'll do a duo duel. Start match. Let's see how laggy this is gonna be. <laughs> oh, Oh, there we go. That was quick. Great, the enemy team. <laughs> Jackson's on a three-win streak, so that's not going to be great. Ravenclaw versus Slytherin. Start with... No, let's not start with the draw. Start with... Witch Snowballs. We'll deal with Austin first, because he's... Oh no, it's Jackson who's on the winning streak. What am I doing? Howler. Oh. Troll. She's already taken a lot of damage. If I can hurry up with the heal, that would be handy. Oh. <laughs> Get out of the way, come on. Run. Walked into it, sweet. <laughs> there we go, and we win. Wow, I can't believe we won that. Jeez. MVP. Hell yeah. That that's the best I've ever done. <laughs> it's like a reversal of when you turn on the, the like you start streaming and you're like bad at the game. I turn on the stream, I'm suddenly I'm good at the game. <laughs> what the hell? Oh man.